Uh, yeah, this is LaRon Scott, uh, representing Georgia Southern University. Uh, the uh, uh, holder to the kickoff returner of the year award. Uh, just to be recognized as the nation's top kickoff returner, it's a great honor. Just, uh, just through hard work and through dedication on the field and, you know, through little things and trying to take the time out to learn things about teams and being able to go out there and execute along with my teammates, thanks to them and their blocking and the execution of those guys. Uh, it, it, it's a wonderful award to be able to, to have and to, to just to hold on to. Uh, yeah, uh, this war being based just strictly on performance, it, it really speaks out a lot of what we were able to accomplish as a unit and as a team on the field, as on these special teams. And uh, I just really want to give all the credit, a lot of the credit to my, my teammates who blocked for me and those guys. And just really appreciate it. It means a lot to, for this just to be all based on stats. I mean, that's really saying, hey, these guys went out and this guy went out and did it. And, uh, he did it to the best. Uh, to describe the kickoff return against Alabama, I, w I would just have to say pure excitement. Uh, I mean, it's set up perfectly. They were definitely a, they're, they're definitely the best at what they do, and uh, those guys were coming down hard and uh, just through hard work and running the ball hard. I was able to find a seam, and I mean, just to get in that end zone in that stadium, uh, it's a feeling like no other. Just pure excitement and just just an unbelievable feeling. Like it was like. It wasn't reality. I mean, it was like a fantasy. And uh, I just definitely tried to soak it all in and definitely enjoy it the moment with my teammates. Just places on at Georgia Southern where you might want to spend some time is, I mean, you have Cone Hall, which is a student academic center where uh, you can get plenty of help with all kind of classes or get tutors and any any help you need with classes. Uh, definitely spend a lot of time in uh, the Paris Center, which is the football facility. Uh, of course, uh, up there watching film, and it's uh, just a great place to go up there and see some, you know, all the history and stuff of Georgia Southern football. And, uh, you know, um, let me see, you can go to any kind of places like to eat. Uh, definitely, it's a lot of friendly people on campus. All it's, Everybody's very friendly and, and uh, very willing to help you with anything you need. And uh, I mean, just a great campus. Uh, the students, the fan base, everything about Georgia Southern, I mean, you just got to love it. Uh, I, I like to, uh, just some hobbies that I have. I like to go out and try to play some basketball, you know, just be, since I played basketball in high school and uh, run a little track, I, I just like to go out and just have fun. Any kind of fun, doing some kind of sport or activity, I mean, it's, it's always fun. Like, I really like to go out and play with my nephews and nieces and my young ones and go outside and just, and just have a good time, just be outside. And, and I just definitely enjoy just hanging out with the family and you know, those, those type of things. Uh, I would uh, I, I would say some attributes that made me successful on kickoff return would definitely be my ability to feel the ball, first of all. you got to be able to feel that thing in. And uh, that, the speed and, and the ability to see things that a lot of people aren't, aren't able to see, like holes and who's coming where, who's doing what. I mean, it, might, it may be bounce left, but if you see he, the, the far, uh, right guy is over pursuing, then, hey, you, have, you can bounce it back. Uh, I think just the ability to see these things and, to notice where the hose is and what's going on and how they're kicking and where they're kicking and the angle of the ball before the kicker even kicks it off and trying to get a jump on where the ball is going. I think all these type of things uh, were, helped me be very successful as a kickoff returner. Uh, yeah, just to be even mentioned with C.J. Spiller and Patrick Peterson on the same on the same page as those guys on what they do and how they've done it. Uh, it's, just, it's just a spectacular feeling, and uh, it's a great honor to even be mentioned with those guys. So I, I definitely soak all that in, and just, just honored to even be considered one of one of the best like they were. I mean, there's always a lot of funny things, a lot of crazy things going on that <laughs> were just undescribable. I, I, I would say one of the funniest moments were uh, we're, we're in the tight game, and uh, we're all, I mean, the whole defense is up on the sideline. And our coach, he, he's, he's talked to us. And like, he's on his knee and got all of us into it, that how the defense has to go out and do good. And the funny thing about with this whole situation, he's talking in one direction. He hits a completely 360 spin on his knee like a <laughs> like a dancer or something. And everybody's like, whoa. Like, I mean, it, it, just, it just totally caught us by surprise. It was definitely a hilarious moment for all of us after the game. Uh... A goal for me um, to be moving forward on a professional level is definitely uh, to get in and, and be at home. Uh, I don't plan on traveling from team to team. Uh, whatever team um, 
if they do decide to take me and bring me into the system, uh, I'm gonna make them think that was, I'm gonna make them know that it was a great decision to bring me in, and and, and it was a really good thing because I'm gonna give them 100 percent, and I'm out there to play full full go wherever they need me to go. I'm a uh, I'm a return like I know how to return. I'm gonna play DB like I know how to play DB, and they're gonna get the full of Ryan Scott. Definitely to talk about some influence people. Uh, First off, my mom, uh, you know, had a hard time growing up, and uh, I definitely look to make things better for my mom while trying to make it to the next level and really focusing hard to try to make it and uh, to where she could uh, sit down and rest and not have to do too much anymore. And uh, my coaches, uh, Coach Orlando mentions, uh, he's a great coach. He look, uh, he looked out for me a lot. Uh, he taught me a lot of the things I know and how to think about this and how to move on to the next level. And uh, he, he he does a good a good job of of coaching when he when he came in he really took me in and made me feel good about staying at Georgia Southern because I you no know, reason to have the coaches leave and uh, he really did a good job and uh, I just got to appreciate him for that. Um, my junior college coach Paige uh, Anders he did a great job. Um, I went to junior college. I wasn't sure if I wanted to stay up there. It was tough on me and he really brought me in and had me do uh, you know just made me feel at home. And, Made, made it a more comfortable uh, experience at, at junior college before I went off to Georgia Southern. I just had to love my whole family. Uh, my dad, my dad, my sisters, they all they all been behind me this whole time. And just the support that I get from my team, my team at Georgia Southern and uh, things like that, just, just the support I get from those guys. I mean, it's a wonderful thing to get that type of support. To send a message out to the Georgia Southern fans, I would have to say they're the best fans I know. They're the greatest people in America, and I, I, I really enjoyed it. They made it one of the best experiences in the world. No matter where I played at, there have been no fans like Georgia Southern. And I, I, I promise to them that I'm going to uh, go out and represent Georgia Southern to the fullest. And on Monday, Sundays and Mondays, they can definitely look to be rooting me on and definitely have my back because I got their back if they need me. And uh, just, hey, I'm Georgia Southern. I bleed blue and white. This is Aaron Scott from Georgia Southern, number 34, uh, Kickoff return of the year, and the significance of this is, I mean, just just to have the opportunity to be mentioned with the greats, and I mean, and to be representing my school and my team in Georgia Southern and those, and those fans and everybody who's always had my back. And I, uh, I just, I just, I really can't even really express how excited I am to have earned, to have earned this award, thanks to my teammates and and the, and the guys on the team. Uh, so, I mean, I really have to say I, I'm just excited about this, and I just appreciate everything.